So some channels make a ridiculous amount of money just from doing very, very basic things and they just go off volume. In this video, we're gonna actually break down this channel that all they do is they pronunciate words. And they literally have thousands of videos. And we're gonna break down the exact numbers and how much money they make. And I'm pretty curious myself to see how much money they can make just pronouncing words and having just a bunch of 10 to 30 second videos. Let's start by announcing last week's winners for thousand dollars worth of courses or consulting calls with me. The winners here. If you guys want to qualify, or if you just drop a comment below, follow me on Instagram, hit the subscribe button, and I'll be picking the best comment every single video. Let's get right into today's video. When you go on Google and you search up how to pronounce here, there is this massive channel called Pronunciation Book. This is just one of the channels. How to pronounce. Um, what's another hard word? Gyro. Pronunciation book pops up again. Um, say entrepreneur. Pronunciation book pops up again. So this channel dominates the pronunciation niche. Wow, it hasn't posted any videos in the past six years. So this isn't even the one that I found. There's like another one. Pronouncing channel. There's the pronunciation manual. Okay, here, there's Rachel's English, pronunciation manual, and pronunciation book. Let's see which one is active. Okay, this one isn't, this is different here. I think this is the one. Nope, this isn't one. They've only been active for the past year. And they pronounce some, a lot of words, like Brad Pitt, or these are um, Cosplay Destiny here, um, Coachella. Lord Brad Pitt Okay, let's see if there's any more. Okay, I found two more channel. There's pronunciation guide and Emma say Pronunciation guide they're pretty inactive Emma saying 500 this is massive. Yep. This is the one that I was looking for Three days ago. She posted one two three four four days ago So this is a very active channel as you can see they're posting and they get very little views because it's just like a normal word. Um, let's go ahead and break down how much each one of these sort of channels make. So let's go to Social Blade. So let's start by going to my channel as a reference. So here's my channel. At 36,000 views, I'm on an upswing guys. Thanks to your support. Keep pushing my channel up guys. Everything's going upwards thanks to you guys. So keep supporting me and I just wanna say thank you. But as of right now, at 36,000 with my particular channel, I roughly make roughly around 500 USD at this monthly view rate. And that's because I'm in a very highly profitable niche because I'm into the how to make money, e-commerce, online marketing, Facebook advertising niche. Um, I get very high CPMs. Let's sort of take these channels um, and sort of put out a much lower CPM. Let's say they make half how much I make just because my CPMs are super high. So worst case possible, they only make $250 per month at 36,000 views. So now let's start by sorting it by subscribers. So we've got 87,100. Okay, perfect. It's already sorted by subscribers. I'm going to search up pronunciation guide. And we're going to put this next to that. Perfect. Pronunciation manual. Pronounce. Nuns. Pronunciation book. Oh, I need to work on my pronunciation. Man, this is a six year old channel. And lastly, is Emma saying. Emma saying must kill it. Let's see how many videos they have. How many videos does she have? Does it say here? Wow, 162,000 uploads. That's crazy. That's like volume. Oh my god. This, these numbers are insane. Okay. So, the pronunciation guide. Whoa. This, she hasn't posted in four years. She only has 87.3k subscribers. She just says a bunch of crazy words. Let's see if it's even her. Prisonary. What? It's just a machine. What? What? This is just Google pronunciation. Holy. D does she have ads? I have ad block on. Let's turn off ad blocker. Pause on this side.
She might not have ads, but 3.2 million. Man, that's insane. So let's start by calculating my CPM first. So let's put this here. Let's make my screen smaller. And let's have this for calculations. So Andy Mai, 36K, 36,000 views equal say $500 for me. Um, but let's say we bring it down to 250. Let's say these channels get half my CPM. So 250 divide that by 36 equals roughly around $7 per thousand views, which is pretty average. Some bad channels like kids channels, they even get like as low as $2 per thousand. But I think with like an educational channel that helps people pronunciate, I'm pretty sure seven dollars per thousand views isn't too bad but the pronunciation guide okay let's write down their stats whoa pronunciation guide uploads three nine let's see how many uploads i have i have roughly 367 subscribers which has 87.2 thousand re estimated revenue estimated revenue equals three thousand two hundred and fifty times up by seven dollars equals three zero five times seven holy twenty two thousand dollars every single month that's insane let's see a chart so wow obviously wow it looks like she's peaking at the moment actually her views are actually up. So previously, she'll be making roughly half the amount. So on average, on the average month consistently, she'll make roughly $10,000 every single month passively. That's insane. Now, obviously, that took a lot of hard work. That took a lot of compounding. As you can see, 400,000 uploads. Not many people can achieve that. but. This is definitely achievable with like a team of virtual assistants. Like I could literally hire 20 virtual assistants just to do this all day round. Even a dictionary doesn't even have 400,000 words. So like, yeah, this is pretty crazy. Next, the pronunciation book. Whoa, way less. Pronunciation book. This one only has 955 uploads. Has more subscribers for some reason. Now let's check the views. Whoa, still pretty good. 1,923,000. That's crazy. And that has only 955 uploads. Damn. So this one is at 13,461. That's pretty crazy. Wow. And that's on a week month. With very little uploads wow man these channels are killing it youtube there's so much space in youtube you can literally create a channel where all you do is just go up volume on these sort of small niche things in this case the niche thing is pronunciation here's another niche thing drake music music box i don't know there's these channels that literally here are three music box all they do is upload music box versions of all these popular songs so we're gonna do a breakdown on this channel next. And they're active 12 hours ago, one day ago. Holy crap, this channel must kill it. This is sort of what I like to do every day. This is the first time I'm bringing you guys on the journey of me actively researching the competitor, trying to break down their numbers. Usually I do this behind the scenes. I've seen no other YouTube actually bring their viewers and show them an over the shoulder look on how they go ahead and really research, do competitor research, market research, and sort of break down what numbers other competitors are doing. I want to go ahead and do this live so that people who are watching my channel can learn how I think, how I come up with ideas, and how I sort of strategically do many different things. This is definitely something I wished a lot of the gurus I followed would sort of share. I want to know what goes behind their minds, how they do market research, and all the things they do. A lot of it's done behind closed bars. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this sort of case study and market research that you guys get to join me with because all this stuff, brand new to me. So you guys are learning just as I'm learning. This is all live, but the next channel pronunciation manual whoa this is a big one whoa even less uploads only 455 like even i nearly have that much and it shows wow 
And as a result, they only have 847. That's still a lot. 847 times up by 7. So he makes roughly around $6,000, which is pretty good. And that's crazy how they're able to survive with so little amount of videos. Maybe they just say names? That's crazy. Let's check out the channel. It looks like it's plateaued. Did very big months at the beginning. But what do they pronounce? Yeah, they just sort of pronounce very um obscure words. Emma saying. I think this one's massive. Look, she's still uploading every single day. It's one. Let's see if it's her or it's a robot. J Warren. T J Warren. What? I'm pretty sure this is like a robot. Then Colin Ryan. What? Man, our whole channel is just like robots. Man, this is just passive money and it's so niche that no one can get into this. Like, this takes a lot of time and effort. You can't like, you have to build a whole system to really get to be able to post. Let's see how much does she post. 164,000. Rupert Everett. Yeah, it's a robot. Literally, she just bought a software that pronounces any word she wants and I bet you a lot of these pronunciations aren't even correct because it's a robot but damn okay let's check her channel man pronunciation guide 400,000 and like they're so inactive they're like six years inactive and they're still able to create $22,000 every single month mind-boggling okay Emma say uploads Four six two five nine two subscribers way more. Maybe she does obscure words. Whoa, four point two million. Holy, she definitely makes the most money out of all these guys. That is thirty thousand two hundred fifty four. $30,000 every single month passively. This is like passive income. This is stuff that no one talks about. Wow. And look, her channel is pretty steady, very steady at 11 million views. That's just insane. Here, I'll give you guys a formula. Like, all you have to do to create a channel like this is one, create a system where you can continuously find new names and new words. Whether that's some list of words, many different um, dictionaries, um, a map of the world where you just have an unlimited source and you can literally get people to scrape words. Then you have that all in an Excel sheet and you highlight every single thing that you've already completed. Then you go ahead and hire a VA and first you have to find a machine that can voice these words. You hire a VA that can sort of go ahead and download the audio for each one of these words and you can hire an editor to plug in the audio and change one of these templated videos. And then find someone to just upload many videos every single day and you can just do that all year round. Wow. Yeah, it's just a bunch of names. You should probably just have a list of like, you know, every single celebrity every single movie and literally with that list you can just keep going forever but obviously you're not going to be making any money until you have at least a thousand uploads that's a hard part that people can't get to no one can have the sort of patience to get to 162,000 uploads imagine how long that will take okay let's do r3 music box they're active man they're still actively posting. And this is shocking to me. Man, they have two channels. Let's go ahead and copy this. $30,000 a month, am I saying? That's crazy. R3 Music Box. Uploads. 13,000. Whoa. That's still pretty good. Man, getting to like six figures in uploads, that's next level. And I'm pretty sure with R3 Music Box, they have a software that can do this as well. 164K subscribers. 1.5 mil, wow, 1562. And over time, this will just keep growing. See how they're on upward trend? Because that's how the YouTube algorithm works. That's how the compound effect works. That's how passive income works. You just sort of slowly snowball bigger and bigger, and they're only on the upswing. If they just keep going, it's just gonna keep growing. Like, they just have to keep this up for another year, and their income will double or even triple. But let's calculate it. Wow, nearly 11,000. So I'm actually going to save this document because this is quite an interesting market research. Um, this just shows that if you have something continuous and passive that could just scale with virtual assistants, definitely worth doing, especially on YouTube through the compound effect. But yeah, that's today's video. 
hopefully this this is something completely different. Um, I sort of just brought you guys on the journey of me doing market research and hopefully you guys were able to learn something following and having a look over my shoulder. This is sort of what entrepreneurs do all day. They do funnel breakdowns, they purchase other people's products, they do a lot of market research. This is just one scenario on what it may look like, what market research may look like and hopefully you could sort of use this concept to sort of spike ideas for yourself because what you saw me do live, I have a lot of ideas that I want to go ahead and implement and things I want to try out just because of this case study. But yeah, hope you guys have an amazing day. Hopefully you're able to learn something. Question of the day, what source of passive income would you like? Do you want to get into real estate? Do you want to get into YouTube, stocks, investments, um, ETFs? Let me know what type of passive income you like. Other than that, Hope you guys have an amazing day. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, hit the like button. I do all this for free because I just want to give so much value back to the community that gave me value when I was initially starting. And that's sort of my passion and goal with these daily videos. On that, hope you guys have an amazing week and I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow with more value. Peace.